And here's some more of those half round shape. Some are engraved, some are have uh, raised letters on them, dating back to the 18 and early 1900s. Here's one arranged with a uh, granite curb. Got some of those stained, and those are granite, you can tell. But they're those half circle. This is Burge. Their name is embossed in the step. Actually, raised letters. 1870 to 1906. 1864 to 1925. And 1871 to 1904. Massive. I'm having to back up to get the whole thing in the shot. And as I said, the whole thing's surrounded with a granite curbing and post. I'll slide down here so I can get a look at the names. Yeah, it looks like some 19, early 1900s to mid 1940s. Huge. Let me walk over here and look at this big red granite one. And there's a couple of red granite ones in here that the engraving on it looks almost brand new. Yet the dates on them are very old. Let's see what kind of date this one's got on it. Obelisk. Three tiered. Actually four if you count the base. Base looks to be made out of Either concrete or a different color granite. Some old ones there. Breaking. I hate to see them broken. Wow. That one's got a polished granite ball. Look at the one in the back back there. We got a crow sitting on that one. What's up, crow? See, look at these. Ancient. Makes you wonder if these are Tartarian people that are buried here or the controllers that control the money. Sixty years, two months, and Three days. Judge C.C. Binkley. 1896. Judge Binkley. His wife was born in 1837. She died in 1870. Granted, it is old. It's chipped and showing signs of wear. But boy, that even though there's black on it, I mean that. I guess red granite just really holds the engraving. But yeah, that's very old. Another old one. There's another Binkley. Huge. They've got a Texas deal. I'm gonna get a peek at this polished ball over here that's really caught my eye and there's another hall over there and that's polished granite here's a Tulson 1869 to 1905 look at that thing it's gorgeous Died in 1922. And 
This one died in 1880. Isn't that beautiful? Here's PG Hall. 1825 to 1856 and 1840 to 1878. Another huge one over there. I mean, they're just everywhere. And there's some more of those half round. They do appear to be granite. But on some of them, I don't know how they raise the letters. This one's got a fence around it. They don't want you in there. Got some markings on the side. Oh, I guess that's an E for the family name. Here's some old ones. 1831 to 1903, they were getting on up there. 1892 to 1918. That one's got a vault on it. Let's see. James was 1824 to 1902. Elizabeth was 1824 to this one off here too because I got to get back from lunch but a lot of military graves in this yard as well special plaques and whatnot this one's been tipped over or broken still pretty 1843 to 1876 1874 to 1922, 1880 to 69, 1910 to 1999. Marble curb marker right there. I don't know. Maybe it had marble and somebody stole it. Anyway, I'll come back out next pretty weather day and get some more shots of this yard it's full of old and huge I mean huge stones one in particular I want to show you hopefully tomorrow that's it for now